community gathered to support Winter Smith's family during a fundraising dinner. The FBI found the two year old's body after searching for her for several days. Her mother's ex boyfriend is now behind bars facing several charges in connection to her death. Seven Action News reporter Darren Cunningham attended that dinner and spoke to Smith's family about the support. Behind me here, you're looking at a labor of love and a strong show of support for the family of Winter Smith as they continue to grieve this tragic loss. A line for food forms inside Triumph Church East Campus, but this isn't just any meal. Well, that's homemade. That's home to food. Local chefs like Cleophas Clark, owner of Club Celebrity, did what they do best. We was more than happy to be a part to help. They cooked and donated dishes and desserts for a community dinner designed to raise funds for the parents of Winter Smith. The two-year-old tragically found dead in an alley on the east side last week after missing for several days. Her mother's ex-boyfriend is currently in custody. Her grandfather, Almont Smith Sr., telling me he's thankful for the support. And the loves and, and prayers, you know, that have been with us from, from day one. It, just, it got me out the house. I've been in the house. Um, been like a week, so it just got me out of the house. I just feel better being around so much love. Winter's grandmother, Sharon Eddings, also thankful for the event organizers. Miami-based chef Starek Smith, widely known on social media as the hungry black man, and local restaurateur, Chef Max Hardy. Every restaurant we've like reached out to was like, Chef, what we need, we got it. Everybody's been, you know, receptive and receptive to just, you know, what we're doing, um, which is great, man. It's more about acknowledging this child who was you know, taken from us and acknowledging the family and providing that level of compassion and support. And I think Detroiters are showing over and over and over that that's a that's a value of the city. Because of his post on social media, Selena Williams says that's how she learned about this worthy cause. It's just kind of like hit home to us because we have a daughter. So any event, anything like that happens, I mean, that's just heartbreaking and you want to do whatever it is that you can do to come out and support your community and show them how much you care and how much you love. Looking for continued support, Winter's grandfather says he and one of his sons created this memorial in the alleyway where she was found, calling it Winter Wonderland. Any volunteers want to come by and help, let's clean that area up, um, show that, you know, it's just not an alley, but it's a... Uh, Memorial is a, a home now. If you are interested in helping with the cleanup efforts for Winter's Teddy Bear Memorial, just look for that information at WXYZ.com. In Detroit, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.